Hello, this is Traveler2613 here and today we are in the market of the town of Kabakan. As you can see, it's a relatively large market like most Filipino markets are. What I do know is that in the UK, the outdoor markets are shrinking and the reason behind this is because people are ordering stuff online and they're not wanting to go out and buy but here in the Philippines since they don't have or some of the locals don't have the Wi-Fi connection they go out to the market which makes sense market as you can see you've got school bags here you've got sandals and you've got this area where the sewage water which looks pretty dodgy which means I'll have to watch my step and make sure I don't trip into or step into it. otherwise I could have nasty diseases of God who knows what nasty disease I would get and here we have a toy store, as you can see, with all the toys and here we have all the different shops down here where you can buy all sorts of different stuff, same way down that way. And the one thing I like about this indoor area is that you can escape from the heat of the sun and be in the shade and also here you've got stationary equipment you've got pencils pens notepads for school which I also like and some light bulbs which are handy because if you for example if your bulb goes out you can just buy one here and take it home yeah See, it looks like I've wandered into the vegetable or fruit market vegetable and fruit market as you can see here you have all the different vegetables and fruits that you can buy yes Okay. Ah, this is what is called Gabe. <laughs> oh, this is a better. That is called Ampalaya. 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 What does that mean? What does that mean? Uh, bitter. Bitter, okay. Yeah. Ampalaya. Oh, this is a okra. Okra, yes. Uh, okra also in uh, English. Oh. Or no, another term, okra. I, th I think I heard it in Spanish. In Spanish? Yeah, I just don't know what. What a vegetable oh, is. This is a mango. What is mango? <laughs> <laughs> this is eggplant. Eggplant. Yes. Eggplant. Oh, and this is calamansi, lemon. Those look like limes. Yeah. <laughs> oh, kanko. 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 Oh, this is a green beans. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Pumpkin, yes. Uh, this is a coconut. A coconut. <laughs> How much is a coconut here? Coconut here, uh, 15 pesos, this one. 15 pe pesos? Yeah. Wow, that's cheap. Uh, not cheap. 15. Oh. You said 15 or 50. Oh, yeah, yeah, 15. 15, yes. Yeah, cheap in Philippines. Oh, sorry, it's just that sometimes 
sometimes 15 and 50 get mixed up sometimes because they sound so similar. Yeah, but different. Yeah, different. 15 yeah. is uh, only 15 pesos. 50 is uh, what is called Filipino people 50 pesos. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Thank you for the helping out there. Thanks for doing this for me. Thanks for doing. We've got shrimp, if that's correct. And we have sardine. Lokoi. Some more shrimp and some more lokoi. Alright, I've just gone back from the fruit and veg market, and she was happy enough to introduce me to the different fruits and vegetables. And. Now I'm going to see if I can find the other fruit and veg market because I know there's another section of the market as a fruit and vegetable market, which I'm definitely going to find. Here we have a mini cafe where you can sit down and eat. We'll into another section of the indoor market which also has fruit and veg, but it looks like there's a wider variety in this stall. We also got this stall that also has a wide variety of fruit and veg as you can see here but mainly it's just vegetables and oil and all that stuff. have some noodles here which have been opened up and are just lying around and we also have some open veggie packets as well. Extra large eggs. <laughs> Here we're in the meat section of the indoor market and you see you've got fish, you've got your meats here, where you've got chicken, you've got liver, which doesn't suit well with me, and you've got, let me see here, we've got shells, we've got shells here, which are oysters and shrimp, and more fish. And of course you got fans to keep you cool during the hot heat, during the hot day. <laughs> Have some chicken feet and some chicken heads. Yeah, it's like pretty, which I'm pretty turned off for by. Don't even know why they're selling it, but we have a guy filleting a fish, cutting out his gills and all that, so you can eat it. Even his tail. Eel. Here you have some eel, fresh cut eel. Some more vegetables. We've got this old woman who's selling vegetables. Is that right? hello there? To the end of my Kabakan market tour. I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure you like and subscribe to my channel. This is Traveler2613 here signing out now.